What's up guys, this is Massey, welcome to another video. In this video I want to show you how to find out the pH of the solution containing 0.75 molar lactic acid and 0.25 molar sodium lactate. Lactic acid is HC3H5O3 and the Ka value for lactic acid is 1.4 times 10 to the power of negative 4. So let's see what kind of species we have in this aqueous system. We have lactic acid, HC3H5O3. We have water and we have sodium lactate. Sodium lactate is dissociated into sodium and the lactate part, which is going to be C3H5O3 minus. H2O is neutral, so it is a very, very, very weak acid or very, very, very weak base, so it doesn't control the pH. Na plus is the conjugate acid of NaOH. NaOH is extremely strong base, so Na plus is going to be extremely weak conjugate acid. So these two don't control value of pH. So we need to focus on this one and the lactate ion. I'm going to write lactic acid. It's going to produce, when it reacts in water, it's going to produce proton plus lactate ion. What is going to be the concentration? Here we have 0.75 before equilibrium. This one is approximately 0, 10 to the power of negative 7. It's going to compare to this one, it's going to be 0. And this one is 0.25. That's I means initial, I stable. C, which is change, is negative X plus X plus X. This one is negative because that's reactant, it's losing. And product is gaining, so that's why there are plus. So it's going to be E for equilibrium is going to be 0 0.75 minus X. X, 0 0.25 plus X. So Ka dissociation constant is going to be 1.4 times 10 to the power of negative 4 equals to x times 0.25 plus x divided by 0.75 minus x now these two cancel out it's going to be x times 0.25 divided by 0.75 so x will be 0.75 times 1.4 times 10 to the power of negative 4 divided by 0.25 is going to be 4.2 times 10 to the power of negative 4 so pH will be negative log 4.2 times 10 to the power of negative 4 it's going to be 3.7 it's going to be the pH of this buffered solution. 